Welcome to the Lady Yum Yum Show. It's the end of a long day and I'm ready for bed, but I know I'm gonna be starving in the morning. So I'm gonna show you one of my breakfasts that I prepare at night and it's all ready for me in the morning. And that's slow cooked oatmeal. You wanna use steel cut oats. Um, so not the rolled oats or the instant oats. These oats are unprocessed, completely unprocessed. So they take a long time to cook, which is why I don't like to make them in the morning. If I put them in at night, they're all ready for me. They're just really hearty and keep you full for a long time. So they're a great breakfast. I'm going to make a double batch of oatmeal, so eight servings, because oatmeal um, freezes well and it microwaves well. So it gives me plenty for the whole week. So I'll use two cups of steel oats. There we go. One. There's my second cup. Now we'll add our liquid. We need uh, four cups of liquid to every cup of oats. We use two cups of oats, that's eight cups of liquid. I like to use a combination of almond milk and the one I like is the low fat vanilla. It adds a little bit of vanilla and a little bit of nuttiness, just perfect combo. So that's why I recommend, there's a couple different brands. This is the brand I'm using today. We're going to use two cups. You can use other types of milk. You can use all milk. You can use all water. It's totally up to you. I just like the flavor of the nuts and the vanilla in the almond milk. And we need six cups of water. Now we'll give it a good stir and we'll cook this for six to eight hours, basically overnight. And at this point, you can also add some fruit. Um, dried fruit works the best, but apples also work. Any hard fruit would work. You don't wanna add, for instance, fresh berries because they just get all mushy cooking that long. So a cup of raisins or um, apricots, any kind of dried fruit you like, or a cup of uh, chopped apple all works great. We'll put on the cover and set it to low, again, for six to eight hours. The first time you make this, you may wanna watch it, do it during the day so you know how long your slow cooker takes to cook. Now, since it's still fall, I found these end of the season blueberries at the market. So I'm going to make a fresh berry compote that'll be ready for me in the morning when my oatmeal's ready. Fresh berry compote's pretty easy to make. I'm starting with 16 ounces of blueberries. And I'll add about a half a cup of orange juice to that. Just so it you know, covers the, the bottom of the pan about an inch. And we'll turn that on high and we bring it to a boil. The natural pectins in the fruit will act as our thickener to our sauce. Once it starts to boil, just give it a stir and watch it. And once the berries start to pop, it's done. It's just a very few minutes. Okay, most of the berries are starting to pop. So at this point, give it a quick taste and you may have to adjust either the sugar or the acid. Mm, it's plenty sweet. The berries were pretty sweet, but it needs a little more acid. So I'll add some lemon juice. a tablespoon of lemon juice will brighten this up and I'll turn off the heat. We'll cover this and leave it in the fridge overnight and it'll be ready for breakfast. Time for bed. Well welcome back. It's a nice crisp fall morning and I have breakfast ready when I am. So I'm gonna dish this out, it's all bubbly. And I use the steel cut oats so that it still has texture. If you tried to do this with rolled oats, it would be kind of mushy in the morning. And I like my oatmeal to have some texture still. And some blueberries. And I like my blueberries cold because I like the contrast of the cold and the warm um, oats. 
but you could always warm these up in the morning too if you want it. There we go. Isn't that pretty? Ah, it's piping hot, which is perfect for a crisp fall morning. Yeah, I can barely hold the bowl, it's so hot. <laughs> Get lots of blueberries here. Mmm. It's really sweet, but it's all natural sugar. None of that processed stuff that's in those instant oatmeal packets. Give this a try. It's perfect back to school. It'll keep the kids or you full all morning long. All the details are on our website.